Hi friends, welcome to Opa Studies YouTube channel. This is part 21 in PySpark playlist. In this video, we are going to discuss about filter and where functions in PySpark. This is similar to SQL where function. So in SQL, when you write a query, you use where class to filter the rows, right? So exactly same thing can be done using these functions on top of data frame. When I practically explain this, you will make more sense of it. Let me go to visual uh, browser. Here, I have already opened my database workspace. Let's go to workspace and here, let's try to create a new notebook. So, right click and create a new notebook here. So, let me right click, create a new notebook and let me name it maybe filter notebook. Python language, this is a cluster. So, let me hit create button to create this notebook and here if you have seen my previous videos you know how to create a data frame so all my videos in PySpark playlist are in a sequence order so please watch them to get most out of it so here I am using a variable called data in which I will be creating three tuple items okay so every tuple will act as one row so this is ID column and then name Mahir and then maybe gender okay like male and then maybe salary okay so similarly let's add another row uh, name Wafa then gender male and salary maybe 3000 okay and then finally let's try to add a third row maybe name Asi and then gender female salary may be 4000 okay so now let's try to add another variable called schema in which i will be supplying column names for my data frame so id column then name column and then gender column and finally we have a salary column so you know that this is spark keyword will actually give you spark session object on top of which we have a create data frame function to which we can supply this data and schema variables to create a data frame. So whatever the data frame this line creates that I am storing in a variable called df. Then finally let's try to use a show function and run the cell to see whether we are able to see our data frame correctly or not. See we got our data frame correctly. Now think like this is a table in SQL. So if this is a table in SQL if you want to take only male employees from here maybe so let's assume this is a employee table then you will be writing a code like this right select star from maybe tbl employee where you will be mentioning gender equals to equals to male so same thing if you want to achieve inside a data frame using PySpark, you can use where are filter functions so let me practically show you that so this data this is a data frame now on top of data frame I will be using this filter function to do that. So before using that, let's use a help function on top of this filter function to see the documentation of it. So whenever you see a documentation of any function, you can clearly see what parameters it explains, expects. So here we have to pass a condition on which the filter should happen. Not only that, you can see examples also here. And when you pass condition here, you can directly refer to a column in a data frame like this or you can use like SQL expression that means simply mention the column name and along with the condition let me practically show you that so here on top of data frame let's try to use a filter and here I am using a condition maybe wherever I see gender so gender column equals to equals to male then filter that rows so whatever the rows it filters let's try to show that so let me hit shift enter now to execute this command and now if you see i can see only male employees not only this this is a normal expression which is referring to some column and running it right so what i can do i can also write a expression in a sql manner so that means here i will be using something like this so in double quotes wherever we have a gender column there if value is male then filter that rows. So let me hit shift enter. We should see the same result. Instead of filter, I can use where also. Even the where function does the same thing. So let me hit shift enter. 
to see the result c not only that for example if you want to use a multiple conditions maybe like where df dot gender equals to equals to male and also i want to use another condition maybe so what i will be doing it here is uh, let's try to use so from here to here one condition so let me wrap that in brackets here from here to here okay sorry from here to here and we can use a second condition also so maybe i want to make sure like if two conditions met if gender is male and salary if sal and salary may be 2000 then only get the rows so if these two conditions met then get the data so according to my data only this row met those two conditions so if i hit shift enter it should give me only mahir right so like this you can use multiple conditions as well i am just showing as an example so basically this where or filter function will help you to filter the rows on top of data frame and as i said use a help function to see a documentation for your better idea and also when you are writing a conditions you can directly point to column like this or you can use a sql kind of expression directly like a column name equals to condition okay so that's it in this video i hope you liked this video thank you for watching please subscribe to my channel and press bell icon to get the notifications whenever i add videos thank you so much